All right, we'll open the floor. Uh, questions for Wiley. Hey, Wiley, uh, of course, highs and lows. Can, can you kind of walk me through first um, that touchdown pass that you had to August Pete? That seemed to be at the point where everything seemed to be clicking. Yeah, uh, we came out of halftime with a lot of good adjustments. Um, we felt very confident in what we were doing on offense, and we just had to make sure we had to get the ball rolling a little bit, and um, we were able to get a good first down, and then we knew when we crossed that 50, we wanted to attack that area. So good play action, be able to get the ball up to August P. When he's wide open, it's it's hard to miss him. So, you know, it was a good play call. Uh, Coach Tui and Coach Bloom right there in that situation, we were able to execute it. So that was a pretty good, pretty good chance right there. And then what kind of change? It's hard to imagine at that point that that would be the last points that y'all would score uh, during the game. What kind of change? Was it something right Arkansas did differently on defense uh, or something that changed on offense that kind of gave y'all a hiccup? I don't think necessarily it's something they did. I think we shot ourselves in the foot a couple times. Um, obviously, you look back at tip pass for an interception, um, interception on the sideline. Like, you can't have those, right? So. Um, just I got to play better from an overall standpoint. The guys expect more from me, and I expect more from myself. So, just ready to move on and ready to get uh, ready to get after this. Get get some good film on this. Uh, get better from it and move on. Was it challenging for you, kind of coming in and out a couple times um, and splitting reps? Um, did it affect you being able to get into a rhythm? No, because that's what I'm called to do. And then what was it like? I know you lost Rosner earlier uh, in the game. Pete came up with a couple big plays, um, had a couple guys on the line going in and out. Um, by the time you were getting to the end of the game, did, was there a feeling like y'all were running out of gas or, or were, were, what was the, the kind of mindset on the, the sideline? Mindset on the sideline is we were going to go down there and score every single time we stepped on the field. Um, those guys brought a lot of energy, brought a lot of juice. Uh, it's something we talked about all week that we had guys that depth, they were ready to play. Um, those guys stepped up today. So I'm proud of those guys, I'm proud of the, the overall team. Uh, same thing on defense, had a couple guys go down, a couple guys step up. So overall, I'm really proud of the guys. We've got a lot to learn and a lot to get better from. And, you know, like you mentioned, just, just one game. What are you, you mentioned, obviously, you, you want to play better. You'd said that. Um, but what kind are you going to take away um, from this experience and, and the totality of this game? We can play with anybody. When we, when we execute and we play physical and we play tough, we can play with anybody. Dudley, you have a question? Yes, can you talk a little bit about did Arkansas do anything different in the second half defensively? And also, Catalan had uh, you know a couple of interceptions. What did you see out of him? Uh, he's a good player. Uh, we knew that coming in. One's going to fly around on the field. Um, but overall, we've got to be able to execute. Um, just a couple miss communications on, on certain points and um, I got to find where one is on the field and so uh, no worries and we'll get better from it so anything else for Wiley thanks Wiley thanks guys